What's up guys? My name is Maro and if you're first time to this YouTube channel, can you subscribe man? You know, I, I'm, I'm in Belize and I've been finding this a lot of questions, this question in my Instagram, everywhere, even before I went to Belize. People asking me, man, how is Belize? Is Belize dangerous? Man, I fear, I fear like, I, I hear more like, Belize city is more dangerous than any other places. What is your take, Ayamaro? Man, my name is Ayamaro, and if it's your first time to this YouTube channel, man, kindly subscribe because I give you information that no news media will give you because me, I go there and feel the experience and show you the experience and you walk with me, you feel it, man. You feel me when I'm walking the street and you're watching my videos. You feel the vibe, you feel the vibration of, my, of me walking in the streets, man. That's why, that's why you need just to subscribe to this YouTube channel, man. <laughs> channel man so is Belize dangerous that's what you're talking about here I would say like this man Belize is like any other country like it could be dangerous depending if you're looking for trouble or it could be as safe as maybe your hometown if you believe your hometown is safe or your home country if you believe your home country is safe but I'll say like this man as a black person first when I was in Belize I didn't feel like I didn't belong I mean like there are too many other black people in Belize so for me it felt like just any other guy walking in the street you know you realize a lot of people ask ask for money hey, that's something I not I noticed yesterday so many people. It must be if you're white, then they really probably would ask you, you know? You oh, look oh, oh, oh. You look like you could be from here. Yeah, 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 actually. But when I tried to make some interview with some taxi drivers, you know sometimes when you speak to taxi drivers, they have a lot of information to sell you. And those are actually the right guys to ever, ever use or ask questions like if you're very new to places they can tell you where to clap they can tell you where to anything you want to find taxi drivers can tell you man because they know those spots like me when i landed in, in belize i didn't know where i was supposed to stay you know i didn't ha i have not i hadn't booked my hotel but this taxi driver took me to a very nice place chill fast internet and i stayed there man it was like boom like it's a place I couldn't have found if I didn't speak to a taxi driver. I have your good friends right here, I'm Rafael. Yeah. Rafael. So yeah. whenever you get out there, you put it out and let them know. Yeah, yeah, Rafael, Rafael. The best taxi driver in Belize, the cheapest and reliable. Yeah, that's true, that's, that's true, that's very true. Because uh, when I arrived here, they told me normally the taxi is $7. And when I told him, he told me 8 I said 7 he was like, okay, it's super good, that's normal price. So yeah, that's what's really good. So it's really dangerous. I'll say like this, the taxi driver told me like there are places at night you're not supposed to walk. That's what he told me. That is in Belize City. So if, if you're near in Belize, please, first is avoid the night, especially in areas you don't see people walking. But, but you see like areas like party places, there are lots of people walking, so it's more safe. And also in those places like party places, you find like security guards are all over around. Then now we, we do hands and legs. You know? Wow. Uh, this, this car blocked my... It blocked my my amazing video capture. Yeah. And but we found this like at night sometimes policemen pass by and they patrol they try to see 
on a motorbikes. We saw them a lot. Yeah. <laughs> Those are police Actually, officers. They're just police now. They're no more police. Yeah, yeah. we've been in Mexico and Spanish yeah. spaces now. Oh, yes, I wanted to police. say cerveza so bad. Oh, and, <laughs> you know? Yeah. I just got from uh, Mexico today. So. Yeah, it's crazy. Like, the streets are always empty. Look how streets are here. That's like some strange thing I've realized. They are empty streets. Yeah. Hey. And also, uh, they use, they use uh, cars, police cars. And during the day, Nearly every hundred meters, every hundred meters in the in the city of Belize, there was a guard, security guard, or there was a policeman. Man, I'm telling you from first-hand experience. So, and when I was walking in the street, I didn't use my big camera. I used to, I, I filmed with my phone and my Osmo. So, in other words, is if you have like really big gadgets that you feel like they can create crazy attention or they can put you in jeopardy of being robbed, the best thing is to avoid them. Like, come up with other options on how you can. You can just visit, chill without uh, creating crazy attention, and you know, be safe. Another thing is, when you go to Belize, try as much as possible. I'm trying to look for the, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to look for the, for the, you know, uh, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to look for the light. Another thing is, when you're going to Belize, try as much as possible to wear clothes which match with the locals. If they wear t-shirts, wear t-shirts. If they were uh, short-sleeved or, you know, what, <clears throat> sorry, you know what I mean. All I mean is try to blend in, try to blend in. The more you blend in, the better for you guys. Yeah. You know, if, if I was here for longer, I would uh, talk to some more girl. You know? Yeah. So my conclusion is, man, Belize is really, really safe. Just go to Belize, have your good time, enjoy, talk to people in the streets. But uh, I found like many people will try to ask you for money in the street. It, maybe it's a normal thing in Belize. I mean, not, they look more of homeless people, you know. They will ask you to buy them food or anything. Yeah, but you know, maybe every country has its own challenges. And that's one challenge I saw in Belize. Like, there are too many, too many people trying to hustle you, ask you for money, and they looked more of homeless people. But I have nothing against the government, man. I think they have programs to, to, to curb that problem. And I want to say, man, ensure you give the video a like, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Belize is safe. All you have to do is don't be flashy. Don't be flashy. Try to merge, you know. Fit, fit in the environment. Try to fit in the environment. That's my last, last thing I can say, yeah. Thank you, and the next video will be how expensive is Belize, okay? Let me say bye man, I'll see you in my next video, please give it a like, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and uh, yeah man, stay safe, more videos to come from Belize, Midnight Belize, bye bye, bye bye, I love you guys, thank you for support, okay, bye.